Hi, my name is Isaiah Gomez, and I'm the founder and CEO of Meripilot. I'm excited to tell you today how we're enabling aquaculture online. First, to tell you a bit about the opportunity. A total of 1.4 billion pounds of shrimp is imported into the USA, mostly from Asia, where it's very environmentally harmful and much more expensive to produce. In the latter half of the 20th century, a rapid increase in technology led US producers to be able to compete with foreign markets. But regulation hampered growth, and the permitting process kept the domestic industry from flourishing. In 2020, we have the Aqua Act that was introduced into the Senate this year, and we also have regulatory changes come from, from the Food and Drug Administration. This allows our farmers to compete with foreign markets. Our farmers can also produce shrimp at a lower cost than the foreign imports, since they don't incur the transportation costs. Also, with the rise of the COVID-19 pandemic, we have an increase in internet sales. Amazon doubled its year-over-year -year profits from 2019 to 2020, and companies like GFresh that are selling seafood direct to consumers raised $20 million Series A funding in 2016. The problem for domestic aquaculture farmers is access. Local shrimp producers have limited access to markets of scale keeping them from being able to scale up and compete with the foreign markets. They also don't have access to open business planning tools. A lot of the financial models are being kept secret by high-priced consultants. The other is that there is not access to cooperative development platforms for these farmers to share ideas, come up with solutions, and work together to produce shrimp for the local markets. Also, retailers and consumers are not able to buy direct from these producers since crops are cyclical and they need a constant supply of shrimp in order to stay in business. The solution is the Meripilot Shrimp Business Platform. We developed a shrimp wholesale portal, which is a, a proprietary custom software that is built for keeping retailers and consumers in shrimp all the time. This also allows for our local US producers to scale up their operations to meet the demand of the retailers and the consumers. We also have the Meriplanner financial tools, which make custom business plans to allow these farmers to scale up operations and gain access to capital. We also have live on our website, the Shrimp Forum, that allows farmers to share ideas and aids in cooperative development. To tell you a bit about us, in 2019, I started development of the alpha version of the farm planning tool while I was working full time at a fish farm in Kailua Kona, Hawaii. I found a few shrimp farms that were willing to work with me, such as J&J &J Dry Dock Shrimp in Forest City, Iowa. I also met Dr. Tony Ostrowski, who has 38 years experience in the field. In 2020, we had Dr. Hansen join. Dr. Terry Hansen is from Auburn University, and he has the most up-to-date financial model for recirculating aquaculture systems in the United States. After he joined, I started getting calls from companies such as Ziegler Brothers and Benchmark Genetics asking for access to these models and access to the software. We also developed the second iteration of the shrimp planning tool, which is live on our website, and launched the Meripilot Shrimp Forum. In 2021, pending funding, we're looking to develop the wholesale portal that we've planned, expand our sales team, and develop the Meripilot mobile app. How we make money is we give farmers free access to the Mara Planner and Forum. We want them to be able to scale up their farms, forecast production, and be able to get cooperative information from each other and educational materials. Through the wholesale portal, when farmers buy supplies and services, we make an average of 16 cents per pound in gate cost. And when the farmers sell the shrimp business to business or direct business to customer, we earn about 40 cents a pound, which equates to a 10% commission on both the sales of supplies and services. With the increase in technology and the decrease in regulation now in 2020, we expect the projected US shrimp farm production to increase to 21 million pounds by 2025. This is in line with what they were doing in 2003 when regulation and permitting process hampered the market. Under the leadership of Dr. Tony Ostrowski, who's one of our advisors, 
in the late part of the 20th century, production reached 15 million pounds per year. Our financial projections are that we will capture 20% of this market by 2025, which equates to a yearly revenue of about two and a half million dollars. Using our own software and our own developers, we expect to be profitable after year 1.5. In this space, no wholesale platform or planning tools exist. We are the only ones that offer a marketplace, educational resources, and financial planning for these operations. RDM Shrimp is a consultant based in Illinois that will charge you a high fee for the educational resources and the financial planning. They don't help you sell the shrimp and they don't help you buy supplies. Pentair is an equipment manufacturer that will sell you equipment, but they won't actually help you develop your farm or plan your finances. The newest forum out is shrimplist.com that was launched by American Pianid in Florida. They don't have the capability to have a marketplace for buying and selling the shrimp and supplies, and they don't offer any financial planning, but there is cooperative development underway. So our team is myself. I developed the first iteration of the Mara Planner software. I am an ex-fish farmer, mariner, and commercial fisherman, and I exited a consumer goods company called Nuff Said in 2018. We have Dr. Tony Ostrowski, who has 35 years in the shrimp agriculture business. He also was the, was the executive chairman of the Marine Shrimp Farming Consortium, under which the domestic product reached 15 million pounds. We have Dr. Terry Hansen, who has the most sought after economic models in the industry. He's a professor at Auburn University. Evan Greer and Adam Shappy are software developers that designed the Maripilot, the Maripilot Forum and the new Mariplanner tools. We're asking for $150,000 investment to make strategic hires and expand our reach into the market besides the traction that we've already found. We're also looking for a seafood sales advisor to help us design the portal in a way that will be attractive to major retailers such as Albertsons, Costco, and Kroger. The best part is that this $20,000 from the Boise Startup Week pitch competition will enable us to build the MVP of our wholesale porter portal to launch by the end of 2020. Once again, my name is Isaiah Gomez, and I'm the founder and CEO of Maripilot. We're located right here in Boise, Idaho, and we look forward to having you help us enable aquaculture online. Thank you.